Hare Krishna. So today, by Gurudev's grace, we went to Champahati, whole party. Very, very beautiful place. Uh, there we heard about Srila Jayadev Goswami. He's a very wonderful poet, from uh, Vaishnava poet, from before the time of Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He wrote beautiful poetry there, Shri Kamala Kocha, and Dasavatar daughter Git Govinda. And afterwards, Shri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he used to relish his poetry so much. So he heard about this wonderful service to Krishna, and how Krishna personally appeared to uh, show him that actually Krishna was subservient to Srimati Radhika. Krishna himself bowed down to Srimati Radhika when she's in Man. And also there's the, uh, there's the deities of Sri Gorgadatha there, there's the first Gorgadatha deity of Vani Nasroi, the brother of Gadatha Pandit. So it's a very beautiful place, you get so much mercy there, beautiful moods, you hear about the moods of the great devotees. Hare Krishna. Uh, the Kajilas Matya of Guru and Vaishnavas. Where are you arrive? This place name is the Samudragad. This place is the, uh, not different to Vrindavan Dham. This is the Gupta Vrindavan. If you do Parikrama guidance of Gurudev, the Navadiv Dham Parikrama, then you can get both fruit, both uh, Parikrama fruit you can get. Okay? And this place is the not different from the Vrindavan. This place is the Bahula Ban. And the Bahula Ban meaning, Hayar, Bahu meaning here, Srimati Radha Rani. One Saki name, her name is the Bahula Saki. She is the bring to Radha Rani to Krishna. And here, Radha Krishna, each other meet to hear. This Ganga, she is the another way. She is the wife of Samudra. One Samudra he told to Ganga, Oh Ganga, you are very, very pursued. Why Krishna, it is very sweet pastime your water. So I am very unfortunate. Ganga told him, don't worry. When Mahabrahu took sannyasi, he also went to Jagannath Puri. And that time he also, with this associate, he also was doing very nice, nice pastime there also. You are also very, very fortunate. So this way, this place is the very, very glory that place. and Vidya. Vidya means two types of Vidya. Avidya and Vidya. She, Shaitanya Mahaprabhu asking question then, asking uh, question to Raya Ramana. Vidya Madhya Kon Vidya Sar. Means, who is the top most Vidya? She, Raya Ramana told that Vidya is teach me in Krishna Bhakti. That is the top most Vidya. So, she, uh, Mahaprabhu all time playing uh, the Vidya mood and the Vidya Nagar is Sarbhum Bhattacharya's birthday place and all Achyan, all my Guru Parampara is bent uh, uh, there and uh, collecting all Vidya from Mahaprabhu. Okay? Okay. Uh, thank you. Radha Pundo. Parikrama that is Rath in Navadivdham that is called Kovala. Kovala means Kavala iti Kovala. That means Krishna Chandra, who is the Supreme Personality of Godhead Bhagavan. When he saw Srimati Radhika little bit far away, then he became very surprised, taking darshan of Srimati Radhika's beauty. For this reason, Krishna, he asked <coughs> other Sati of Simatika, who is that girl who is beautiful and so much shining and delightful and so much luster coming from her body. For this reason, that place is called Kovala, that means who is that girl. So, this is called Kovala in Navadipta. And Bhaktivinoda Thakur has mentioned that is called Radha Kunda. Radha Kunda is non different from Srimati Radhika. And Krishna performed sweet Christ Rasa in on the bank of Radha Kunda that is called 
Maha Aras. So this is the teacher of Gauriya Vaishnava. How to attain the highest perfection of this Radha Pandit. Gauriya Maha Today our program party went to Sri Champahati, the place of Sri Gaur Gadadhar, and right there in the heart of Champahati, the very sacred and holy place, place the birthplace of a Guru Vaishnava, dear associate of Sri Gurudev, that's our dear Sri Pramananda Prabhu. And I, in my own life, I saw it numerous occasions, Gurudev, he would come to that place every year and make a point to come there. And while he was there, Gurudev, he would speak the glories of Vaishnava and Gurudev once he was sitting in a chair and he was actually he was crying, he was feeling so much deep emotion and he was saying that it's more beneficial to go to the house of a Vaishnava than it is to visit a Vishnu Mandir. So just like we have gone to Shiva Sangan and Advaita Angan, Gadadhar Angan, so today now you have come to Premananda Angan. Another year, another occasion I saw him, he was sitting there and he was saying he was crying and he was saying that oh no one has performed Vaishnava Seva like Premananda has performed. So in this way, Gurudev, he made it a point every year to go there and glorify Sri Padmanandha Prabhu and show that what is the uh, true position of a real Guru Sevak, such Shishya. And he was, in this way, bring, you know, glorifying Sri Padmanandha Prabhu.